Hi. Well, my name's Iris. Welcome back to another video. It's been a while since I've uploaded a video, but here we are today. So, yeah. Today I'm going to do a 50 facts about me video, and I hope you enjoy this video. <laughs> so let's get this started. So the first one is that I was born in Auckland, New Zealand and I've lived in the same place for the entirety of my life which is 22 years and my birthday is in April I have one older brother and that's number four um, <laughs> Five is that I get scared really easily so like when people like sneak behind me and like scare me I always or most always get scared and jump so yeah I can speak three languages I can speak English Cantonese and French I actually quite like to travel and explore so like like going home for walks going on road trips or even going to like another country so like playing rides and stuff like that um, I've been to eight different countries and cities. So I've been to Melbourne, Australia, which was my most recent trip. Um, I've been to Hong Kong, Nagoya, Japan. I've been to South Korea. I don't know what I'm doing with my hands. <laughs> I've been to Beijing, China. And um, I've been to Paris and France. I've been to Rouge in Belgium and of course I've been in New Zealand because that's where I live um, and if I were to travel to any country right now you know despite the whole situation that's happening in, in the world I would love to go back to France because it's been like six years since I've been there and I would definitely love to go back and like explore Europe and all that. Um, number 10, I've, I went to a Catholic high school, even though I'm all, I wasn't Catholic, but yeah. <laughs> um, I played badminton for 10 years. I don't play it anymore, but yeah, I started when I was like, how old was I? I was like 8, and then I stopped when I was about 18, so when high school finished. Um, I was going to study architecture during university or like something like interior design but I actually ended up studying hospitality in university because things change. Um, I actually have a certificate in hospitality, tourism and events from AUT which is Auckland University of Technology and I also have my bachelor's degree in international hospitality management and majoring in event management. Yeah. I actually just finished that degree not too long ago, so it's about two about three months ago now. And up until then I actually never failed a uni paper until my final paper. So yeah, that's why I actually just finished my degree this year. I was supposed to finish last year in November, but I failed, so yeah, I had to retake that. Okay, number 16. Well, my favourite food is fried chicken. Um, my go-to drink is usually coffee or like bubble tea. Really depends on my mood. My favorite soft drink is Fanta. My favorite type of chocolate is white chocolate. I prefer drinking beer over wine. Even though like I love eating, I'm actually a really picky eater. Like, going on with the like, like, being a picky eater, I don't actually like any sauces or like burgers. So like I don't like tomato sauce. Um, number twenty three is that I almost never read books, even though I probably should, but. I have like a ton of books over there, like in my bookshelf, and I haven't read any of them really, so yeah, that's great. <laughs> um, my favourite band to listen to right now, or like my favourite band in general is Five Seconds of Summer, 
I've always loved them. I started listening to them in 2014, haven't stopped, and yeah. My favourite movie right now is probably Nerve. That's a really cool movie. My favourite TV series is probably Pretty Little Liars. If I were to meet one celebrity or person right now, like I'll probably meet any member from Five Seconds or Summer or even Harry Holland. I don't know why. Yeah. Um, I really love watching romantic comedy movies. I don't know why, but I do. Um, I'm an introvert, but I'm also like like a little bit intro but extrovert. But I'm most mostly an introvert, so I like to stay home. <laughs> but I would say that I, will, I am a little bit of an extrovert, cause only because I work at an arcade bar and that kind of brings a different side of me but yeah that I think is my third job and yeah I'm having so much fun right now at my jobs even though I don't work that much but yeah it is what it is so yeah so yeah I work at an arcade bar as my third job um, the last job I had was working at a dumpling shop slash food truck and then my first one being a sushi shop. Uh, 31 is that uh, I actually got hired in my current job by saying one really weird fun fact about myself during the interview and it was that I am a banana. <laughs> so yeah. I only said that because I could relate to it because I'm yellow on the outside, white on the inside, and that's how I got hired. Um, number 32, I actually consider myself to be quite socially awkward, so yeah. Um, I actually never owned a pet, so I didn't have a goldfish, didn't have a cat, a dog, none. Um, I actually wear contact lenses so my vision is not the best <laughs> so yeah I actually wear the also key lenses the ones that you wear at night so I actually don't have to wear any contact lenses during the day my eyes are watery or dry watery or, yeah number 35 I'm more of a night owl than I am a morning person only because I feel like I'm more productive during the night and I get my work done then so I always tend to stay up until I'm back to a.m. but yeah number 36 my favorite color is pink purple and blue I don't I don't have a specific color that I like but yeah those are my favorite colors uh, number 37, my hair actually is naturally straight. Um, number 38, as you can probably tell, you probably can't, but I've actually had my hair dyed once, it was like a year ago now. So it was balayaged and it was kind of like a, I don't know, like a, I was trying to go for a blonde kind of colour, but it was like more of a, I guess like, gold bronzy type colour and I want to dye it more in the future I want to dye my hair like you know weird colours <laughs> I don't know um I actually have two ear piercings well like two on each ear you probably can't tell so I have two on this ear or two on my earlobes number 40 I don't have any tattoos but I want some in the future I I don't know. Uh, I know what I want, but I just don't know where I want them. So like, I want some like my wrist, and I don't know, maybe like the shoulder. I, I have no idea. Uh, number forty-one. Um, if I were to wear one type of shoe for the rest of my life, it would probably be Converse's shoes. I'm even wearing a Converse shirt. That's how much I love that brand. Um, number forty-two. I have an obsession with buying like stationery. So like I like I buy like a lot of pens, books, anything that has to do with stationery, I will buy without like, without any hesitation. I would buy <laughs> number forty three. I still play Pokemon Go. It's kind of the only reason why I go out sometimes, <laughs> which is kind of bad. <laughs> but yeah, um, number forty four. 
Um, since finishing uni, I have a lot of projects and stuff that I want to like accomplish and do at home. So yeah, um, so I want to like make stickers. I want to bullet journaling. I want to, I don't know, just like a lot of stuff that I want to do. Oh, friendship bracelets is one another, is another thing that I want to do. So yeah, hopefully I'll get those done. <laughs> Uh, number 45 is that I actually quite like listening to music quite a bit so like whenever I get a chance to I, I always just always put my earphones in like jam to some music and typically I would like listen to like 5 Seconds of Summer, The Driver Era, Shawn Mendes and like yeah those kind of stuff like We The Kings, All Time Low basically anything like pop rock kind of that kind of genre <laughs> so yeah Number 46, I've never had braces before or even like design or whatnot. 47, I still actually live at home but if I were to move out I'll probably live in like like a city centre or an, an apartment. So yeah. Number 48 is I own a lot of things. Like everything I own is actually in my room basically but like if you were to come to my room you would see how many things I have. Like, Honestly, I don't know how I keep buying stuff and it somehow still fits in my room. Like, I have books and toys over there, I have some jackets in there, I have clothes in there. Number 49 is that I actually have a sweet tooth. So like anything that's like sweet, I will eat. So like creme brulee, macarons, cookies. And number 50, the final fact is I actually like going for walks on the beach and I only put this in there because one time at work um, we were on like radios and like we would have to say like one thing that you guys like to do like you know like an interesting fact yeah didn't know what to say so like and I wasn't like paying attention at all so like my manager said oh um yeah Iris likes to go on long walks on the beach and it's like like I wasn't like fully paying attention so I was like so what I said was like I don't like to go on walks on beaches <laughs> I don't know like I said it in a way that I like I was like unsure because like I was I wasn't sure it was like directed to me or like what so yeah I just had to put that in there. I like to go on long walks on the beach. But yeah, anyways, um, that's 50 things about me. Um, <laughs> yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you really want to. Subscribe if you haven't. And yeah! <laughs>